Hello everyone. Uh, today we're going to talk about a continuous rotation servo. Um, and if you haven't run into these before, a continuous rotation servo is basically just a speed controlled motor. It takes a PWM signal, PWM signal from uh, whatever you happen to be using, uh, uh, your Arduino or basic stamp or whatever kind of chip you're giving it, and you feed this into here. It'll be a PWM signal from 0 to 180, just like a standard servo. But when you send that signal and power to the servo, it doesn't just turn to some angle and stop. It just continuously rotates. And this PWM signal defines the speed of that rotation. So zero, but what's odd about this is zero is actually rotating backwards and 180 is rotating forwards, both at full speeds. So actually, 90 is stopped. Which is a little bit weird to say that, oh, the number, a large number means stop. Well, this is how it works. Since you're only able to send a PWM signal from 0 to 180, the way you have to do this is you have to kind of define speed of backwards, forwards, and stopped, just like this. And this is 90, 180, and zero. Now, it, this is sort of confusing to work with. So what I like to do inside of my code when I'm controlling one of these is actually whatever it is speed I want it to go, I want to put in a number of like negative 90. I want this to be uh, negative 90, zero, 90. Because negative is opposite, so backwards. So zero is zero, so stop. And 90 is a big positive number, so go forward at max speed. So what you can do is actually normalize these so whatever you can put in your speed, however you're reading your speed, have somebody put it in in the serial monitor somehow as from negative 90 to 90, and then you go ahead and just add 90 to it. If you put in some value in a serial monitor or some other controller, add 90, it converts to this up here because negative 90 plus 90 is 0. 0 plus 90 is 90. 90 plus 90 is 180. And now you've converted it back into what this thing actually receives. This thing has to have a PWM signal from 0 to 180. Once you've got that, you've got a pretty nifty speed controlled motor here that you can just plug into basically any Arduino and control the speed of the robot with it. So they're very useful for that. So just to review, a continuous rotation servo is a servo that rotates continuously over and over and over again, 360 degrees over and over again, never stops. It does not shoot to some angle. You use a PWM signal to control the speed and a pure signal of 90 stops the motor. 180 keeps it moving forward at top speed. Zero moves it backwards at top speed, but you can normalize those values so that you can, it's easier for you to work with by adding 90 to some other range. If that's not clear, go ahead and review what I just went through before, um, and I did a little drawing on that. All right, that's continuous rotation servos, guys.